What's up, everybody? It's John with John Sports Cards coming at you with a brand new video on this Friday. TGIF, everybody. Thank you know what? It's Friday. So we're here today. We're going to open up this very rare and now completely sold out Universal Treasures, the best vintage baseball card search in the universe, the green box. This has been extremely, extremely uh, good to us. Let's just put it that way. This product and um, I have pulled some massive cards out of this, massive rookie cards out of this uh, out of this product. We pulled a, a 67 Mickey Mantle out of here. We pulled this Henderson right here. Uh, I believe I've gotten um, Ryan Sandberg. Uh, we pulled a, a 1970 Clemente. Uh, 60, I think it was a 60 or 69 Willie Mays out of here too. So, and some other really awesome, awesome cards. Um, this is all Topps product from 1952 to 1983. There are 21 packs inside here, 147 cards, and it's all Topps. So we're going to also have one Hall of Fame rel autograph or relic card in every box. That's usually like a Panini product. Um, I think they're taking it from the Cooperstown collection, something along those lines. So we've gotten um, Paul Molitor, Fergie Jenkins, and then I'm trying to think of the other one. might have been a relic. Uh, maybe Al K line. I can't remember off the top of my head, but it's been you know you can go back and look at those videos and watch those. Those are awesome. They're th these are like our you know in our top ten most viewed videos. So we're gonna open this up today. I was gonna do this live. Uh, I decided not to do this live. We did a live stream earlier this week as a test, and it actually went well. I just wasn't pleased with. Uh, how long it took for the video to actually upload and um, to be seen by everybody. It was seen at portions of time by, by certain people a few hours after um, I ended it. But then it took almost 12 to 14 hours for it to actually show up fully for everybody. I did not want to do that uh, with this product. So we're filming this. It's uh, close to 5.50 p.m. on Friday. What is it, July 24th? Um, I believe that's the date today on <laughs> top of my head. So you know what time and date stamp there for that. Um, let's get this open and uh, see what we can find inside. I've got my penny sleeves, got my card uh, stands here. We've got the hip bell next to us here. Um, so we're gonna dive into this and see what we can pull out of here today. This is the last one, like I said, of this that I have personally. It's sold out on the website. I think a lot of that had to do with the videos that I, um, that I made uh here on the showcase in this product i have no affiliation with with uh, universal treasures or the um the distributor um but uh they've done a great job with this product so i'm, I'm very very pleased some people have had great boxes some have had okay boxes i don't know what to expect this time around i've been lucky three times in a row can we do it a fourth time that's really the question so let's get this open this is serial number on here it's box uh uh uh, 221199, 22,199 at 25,000. Um, and let's go. Let's open this up and see what we can pull out of here today. Oops. Uh, we'll go back here with it. Everything on camera so you guys can see. You can see the um, Universal Treasures logo. You know, this is all valid and good. Not tampered with. The seal is good. Get this off of here. I like to do all this stuff on camera, and um, so that there are no questions. This came out in 2014. Okay, and there we go. Let's get this open. Get the packs out of here and see what we can find. here let's just tilt it a little bit so i can see what i'm looking at and away we go okay okay all right here's pack number one here's what they look like you've seen this is the fourth time like i said fourth go around um if we can pull a mickey mantle card out of here it doesn't matter the year i will be super super stoked and freaked out and you'll know it here's the back of these look like there actually are odds on here so you want to Freeze that and take a look. Let's open up the first one. We're gonna use our scissors on this because I don't want to damage the cards. Try to pull the wrapper open a little difficult. Make sure everything's down and away we go. Pack number one of our last 2014 Universal Treasures box. Okay, 
Let's see, I also got my cheat sheet over here. We'll get this on, hold on a second. Got Joe Gaines starting us out here, but let me, uh, here we go, hold on a second. Sorry guys, I've got my um, cheat sheet of the years for, for the Topps cards next to me. So, because there's a few years that I'm not familiar with and yes. So we got 66 tops right here, Joe Gaines. Again, the cards are in phenomenal shape. It's unbelievable, sharp, sharp corners. I'd never have any issues with these cards in this product. So there's Joe Gaines, nice Johnny Bench from 79 tops. Let's put all the Hall of Famers in one pile. Cesar Tovar. It's the back of this, from 74. John Morris from 75. Good stuff there. Okay, Joaquin Andahar. 79 tops, a lost center, but not too bad. Nice, Yaz, Carly Stremski. Hall of Famer right there from 1988 tops, very nice card. Very cool, we have Ed Farmer from 1982 tops. All right, next pack. It's not a bad pack. We got two Hall of Famers out of there. Nice 66. It's in great shape. And some other nice goodies in there. Okay, Steve Dunning. Some 73. Now you can definitely tell he has a painted hat on there. And I wish I knew what, uh, what does that uniform say? We'll be able to tell if we look in the back here. Indiana, so he must have been on the mind. This is like a rookie card for Steve Dunning. There you go with that from 73. Nice sporting news, Babe Ruth. Very nice stuff there. Um, and this is from 76 tops. Very nice stuff there, the Babe. Nice Dave Kingman. That's a good one from 75. Take that card, not in the Hall of Fame, but... Nice name, rookie second baseman here. Nice, little sweet Lou. It's pretty cool. A little bit of a stain or something on there, but that's okay. Take that card. Not too bad. Then the showcase pile came in over here. That's a nice 75 of him. Mets prospects, Juan Berenger, Dwight Bernard, and Dan Norman. 79 tops. Nice Butch Hobson here from 1981. And we have a nice Fred Lynn from 83 here on the Angels, supporting the stash and the action shot. All right, next next pack. You go very slow with this because I want to enjoy these cards. You guys like seeing them. And um, here we go. Tommy Aaron. Tommy Lee Aaron. That's not Hank Aaron, is it? I don't know. Let me look right now since I have this in. Nice, nice, nice. 1978 tops. Tommy Aaron. Let me open that up and see. I would think it would say Hank. If it's Hank Aaron, I'm going to be freaking out in a second, but I don't think that's who that is. All right, come on, search. It's Hank's brother. We'll find out. I never heard of Tommy Aaron before. The younger brother of Hank Aaron. Okay, so that's not too bad. 1970 tops. Okay, we'll take that card. It looks a little bit like him too, being that they're brothers. But I mean, if you look at this, this, you know, you can <laughs> a quick flash by. You might think that that was uh, him. So this is cool. Like that one there with Negro and Ryan, Nolan Ryan. Juan Beniquez, 1975 tops. Nice card there. Pepe Frias. It's a nice one. Stan Bonson, 79. Charlie Spikes from 1980 tops. And UL Washington, 
The fifth year card for him, A2 Tops. Love the A2 Tops design. All right, let's keep going here. So I got a little sidetracked there with uh, Tommy Aaron. Just threw me off for, for a split second. Let me get my other. Okay. Okay, here we go. Next pack. Carmelo Carry On. All kinds of issues here. Using one of our tablets that we have here. Here we go. So, this is 63. And I don't, I don't think I have any of these 63s. This is in like prime shape. My God. Look at the color. I mean, look at that. It looks like so fresh. Like this is just stored um, in a really, really nice space. Jim Barr from 77. Nice! Reggie Jackson, 1970 Tops. Beautiful. Let's put this in a penny sleeve. That's a nice one. We'll take that card. Do not have that, obviously. Thank you, Universal Treasures, for that card. That's nice. Good stuff here. Let's take a closer look at this. It's a little off-center, but the corners on this, man, are, like, unreal. This... Yeah, this is a nice card. I mean, this is something that I would maybe send in a PSA. It's not a 10. Um, and I'll look up the pricing on that. But I, my guess is that this is going to end up being, even though it's off center, probably like an 8. I mean, maybe, maybe a 9. I don't know if it'll go that high. But it's a really, really nice card right here. Holy smokes, it's a good one. Mr. October. Okay. Can you guys see that? I think you probably can. There you go. Okay, Mr. Bill Singer, 74, Bill the Spaceman Lee from 79, Biff Pokoroba, 81 tops, and George Orta, 82 tops. Okay, so that was a nice car to get out of here. Mr. Jackson, okay. Okay, next pack. Willie Horton. It's a nice one. No name there. 73. Nice. Mickey Mantle and Don Newcomb. But this is from 75. I mean, I'll take this card, though. I will take that card. Most valuable players from 56. Pretty sweet. Joe Altabelli, 78, I'm sorry, yes, I'm right, 77, wait, no, 78, no, I'm looking at the thing here, <laughs> oh my goodness gracious, 77 tops, 78 tops, sorry, I get thrown up by the years of him on the back, which are like not right, so, okay, Manager card. Dave Tobik from 81. This is very nice, too. Very, very nice. Ricky Henderson, Rick Langford. 83. Take that card. Nice Hall of Famer there. Gary Tom Thomason from 79. And we end with Gary Templeton. From 83 tops. All right, let's let's um, let's go with this. Let's just finish out the stack. We'll do this stack first on the right. Okay. Jim Fergosi. It's pretty sweet. Fifteen seventy three. Now, what is this? Kurt Pavacqua, 1975 Joe Garagiola Bazooka Bubblegum Blowing Champion. Champ. Kurt Pavacqua. That's a wild card. From 76. It's kind of weird and wild. Wacky. Interesting. Dodgers uh, prospects from 79. Pedro Guerrero. 
Okay, we'll take that. It's not too bad. Rudy Longer Simpson. Next up, Rick Dempsey. 75 tops. Rod Scurry from 81. Dave Frost from 83. And we have a nice Ron Guidry from 78. Good stuff there. Okay, next pack. What are we on? One, two, three. Pack number seven. Nice Jerry Royce uh, rookie. Rookie stars card here for the cards. Very cool. LaRon Lee from 1970 Tops. Followed by a nice Andre Dawson from 82 Tops. Followed by Dave Rader from 75. I love, this is like one of my favorite designs. So 72, and they don't put a lot of 72s uh, in here. 71 is very rare to find as well. That's a nice card there. Nice uh, Chicago Cubs team card. It's beautiful stuff right there. Nice Joe Nolan from 79. Steve Ranko from 80. And Dave Frost from 82. Speaking of 72, here it is. Ed Cranepool. It's a very nice card. Very good stuff there. Ron LaFleur from 77. Let's look at the back of the 72s too. Here's what they look like. Love this year. Nice. Yes. From 76. That is in beautiful shape. Holy smokes. Look at that. That is unreal. Centering is just a little bit off left to right. Top to bottom a little bit off. But it's a sharp, sharp card right there. Nice stuff. Okay, 79, Paul Lindblad. The Yankees. Tony Perez, Hall of Famer from 83. Nice, Reggie Jackson, 1980 tops. That's a nice one, too. They definitely love the, love the Reg here. 1976, Jack Billingham. In really, really good shape as well. Unbelievable. So got some good cards out of that pack. Let's keep going here. Let's keep going. Beautiful Hal McCray. I say 72 and then they start showing up. They don't have any 72s that much in here. Here's two of them already. That's a really nice card. Is that a rookie card? Uh, no, probably not. Third year. That is beautiful, too. Thurman Munson from 76. That is a beautiful card as well. We're going to showcase him. That is sharp. I do not have that card. That's nice. Boog Powell. Another good one. I don't know if Boog's in the Hall of Fame or not, but um, he played in the Orioles for like the longest time. Look at that. And then the Indians. That's probably near the end of his career is my guess. Nice 77 tops there. Larry Gura from 76. Beautiful. Nice. Yes, from 79. Man, getting some good names in here. Rob Piccolo from 80 tops and Fred Norman from 81. They throw the, you know, the, the, the lesser guys in to balance it out. You know, you're not going to get a whole. Every pack's going to have massive, massive, huge names. You're going to get a couple and then a couple, you know, not very, not very known players, you know, mid-level, low-level guys. Okay. Jose Tartable. And, um... This is, uh, 66. We've got a beautiful George Brett fall, following this up, too. That's a nice card right there from 77. Very, very nice card. We have a fifth year card. Well, 75. Well, no, I don't know. So 75 was his rookie, right? Um, but so I believe 75 was his rookie. It was 74. Regardless, it's a very nice card. Hall of Famer there, George Brett. John Candelaria, the Candyman. Nice one from 77 as well. Felix Milan from 76. 
Bob Ochinko from 79. Love that old Padres uniform right there. Pat Underwood from um, 1980 Tops and Roy Lee Jackson from 82. So, a couple of really nice cards out of there. All right, Bob Bailey starts out, Montreal Expos. Sporting News, Lefty Grove. From 76 tops. Ken Henderson. Love the old White Sox uniform there, too. 76, rookie first baseman, Wayne Cage, Ted Cox, Pat Putnam, and Dave Revering. So a couple names have made it. Reverend did, Putnam did, Ted Cox, I can't remember, Wayne Cage, I think. Not 100% sure. Nice, Willie McCovey, 75 tops. Look at that in the Padres. Oh, it's got a big, some weird stain in the back. God dang it, why would that be in here like that? Well, you can't win them all, still very nice. Hall of Famer, Willie McCovey. That might, was that near the end of his career? It had to have been. Yeah, so it must have been near the end. Still a beautiful card. Hall of Famer there, William Covey. We'll highlight him. Adrian Devine from 81 Tops. Nice um, nice Andre Dawson from 80, 83 Tops. Beautiful. The Hawk. That had a bunch of nice cards in it. Very happy with this box. And we still have a ways to go. So we're going to, I imagine we're going to get something pretty good in here. Um, can only go up and up and up. Okay. 72 rookie stars, Bert Hooten, Gene Heisler, and uh, I think it's Ed Stevenson. That's very nice. Look at this, Detroit Tigers, Ralph Halk, the manager. And then what year was this one from? Let's see if it says back here, 76. Very nice. Stuff right there, okay. Glenn Abbott from 77 tops. Oh, you gotta be... Yes! 1976 Tops Nolan Ryan. That is beautiful. I mean, that is a prime card right there. It's a little off center. The corners look really, really nice. This would definitely be PSA worthy. Not a 10, but I would think an 8 or a 9. Based on that, the corners look pretty dang good, too. My God. Let's get a penny sleep for that. Holy smokes. That's beautiful, good stuff right here. Nice. Okay. So we're going to move Mr. Jackson over here. And put Mr. Ryan right next to him. That is a good card. Now, that's the second one of those that I have. I don't think I had one as a child. We pulled one out of this uh, YouTuber who's gone now and did a repack pro product. But um, those had to have been from his own collection. And he just, I, I, you can go back and watch that video. Let's focus on this. But that's a beautiful, beautiful card. Buddy Bell from 78. Gary Alexander from 81, and Keith Hernandez from 83 Tops. All right, let's do the next stack. We already started on that. I can't remember. I'm just floored by that, Ryan. That is beautiful. It's not his rookie or anything, but it's still a really nice card. I think it's pretty valuable, too. So, all right, here we go. Matty Alou. It's a nice one. Leo Cardenas. I screwed his name up. 75 Tops. Oh! Yeah! Look at that, Robin Younts. Is this his rookie or no? His rookie was 75. So second year card for him. But that's still beautiful. Look at that again. Unreal. Let's put his sleeve up, Mr. Younts. Hall of Famer there. Rookie outfielders and next. Okay, we'll go review that in one second. That's a nice one. We fit him somewhere up here. Going to be blocking the box a little bit, but so what? Okay. Hands are stinging a little bit from all the <laughs> clapping I'm doing here. All right, so you got Dell, Allen, Alston, Rick Bassetti, um, Mike Easler, Keith Smith. It's from 78. Okay. Floyd Bannister from 81. Bob Stanley from 83, and we end with Steve Hargan from 76. Oh. 
to Kubiak from 72. Nice, Way Boggs, rookie. Yes. Awesome. Beautiful, good stuff there. I don't have any room up, up, up top. I'm going to have to put him aside and showcase him in a second. That is good, beautiful card right there. Look at that. A lost center, but the corners are unreal. It's a prime nice card. Let's see. We'll just put him right there for now. We'll showcase him at the end. Wow. Okay. Bill Fahey from 75. Dave Frizzly, Frizzlebin. Frizzlebin. Probably crushed that from 76. Uh, Skip Lockwood from 79. Templeton Highlights from 80. And Dane Orge from 82. All right. We still have our hit, so to speak, hit in this as well. Coming up. And we've got how many packs left here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven to go. So what else are we going to find here? This has been awesome. A totally different box with, like, Cards I wasn't expecting, and it's just been very, very nice. 72 tops, uh, sitting a Padres team card. 75, Tom Hilgendorf. Dave Gusty. It's a nice card right there from 76 tops. Nice Tom Seaver. It's got to be from 76 as well. Hall of Famer there. Larry Parrish, 78. Jim Wolford from 81. Sparky Lyle from 83. Okay, here we go. Got a 71 in here. Ron Brand. Not too bad. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Yeah, hold on a second. I don't think this is his rookie card is 76, I believe. Um, that's a very nice card right there. Nice Eck. That's very, very good. Let's put him down, these down here. Um, so 70, I don't know if he's, he had a card. He must have had a card in 75. I don't know, maybe he was in 74. But that's still a very, very nice uh, card there. There he is on the Indians. Hall of Famer Dennis Eckersley Eck. Tom House. Glenn, that's from 77 Tops. Glenn Abbott from 76. Roy Thomas from 79. Tony Armas from 80. And we have Rich Gevin from 82. Another 71. Jerry Stevenson. <laughs> Just when I said, ah, oh, that was 72 is really in here. 71s. I mean, we've gotten some already. It's pretty nice. Mickey Rivers from 76. Fred Kendall from 77. Nice. Hall of Famer Rocky, Raleigh, I was a Rocky Fingers. Raleigh Fingers. Sporting the handlebar mustache. That's from 79 tops. Very nice stuff there. Bake McBride from 8 tops. Rich Gale from 82. And we end with nice Rob Sparing from 76 tops. Let's keep going here. Some mojo magic happening on these last few packs. It's been pretty dang good. That's all I gotta say. Pretty, pretty good. Awesome. Hold on a second. I gotta get my cheat sheet out. I don't want to screw up the year. I can look on the back, but I always get screwed up somehow. Oh no, we can tell. This is a 59. That's very nice. Whitey Lockman. First baseman for the Baltimore Orioles. Nice stuff there. Tony Taylor. Dale Murray, 77. Jerry Royce from 76. Very nice stuff there. National League All-Star pitcher. Gene Garber from 81. Cubs future stars. Jay, Powell, Jay Howell. Carlos Lescano and Ty Waller from A2. And the last card of the pack is Bob Lacey from 1980 Tops. Okay, we got three more packs to go. I have a feeling that the, well, we, I can't tell what's in them. Uh, and then uh, this has a relic in it. I think we're going to stuck with a relic and not an auto. But that's okay. Usually some pretty big names. I mean, it's a, you never know. It could be a duel. Okay, three more packs to go. Here we go. 
What are we going to find? Paul Limblad, 68. It's the coloring of these. Are, I mean, these look like pack fresh. That's how nice these are. Very, very nice. Bucky Dent from 79. Okay, let's see who's on here. Okay, uh, 75 rookie outfielders. Niles, Nyman, Benny Ayala, Tommy Smith, and Jerry Turner. Okay. Dan Schatzer from 81. Oh, yeah! Holy smokes, look at that. Hey, and Hank Aaron. Holy smokes. Wow. From 76. Now it's a little off-center. It's poorly cut. It's still a great card. I actually have this card. Um, I pulled this actually out of a pack as a kid when I was seven. And um, it's got some dink corners. Now this is all, you know, obviously uh, miscut, but it's still a really, really nice card. Nice Hall of Famer here. It's got some sort of something going on there, but I will take this card. doesn't matter. I'm not looking to flip that or anything like that. That's a beautiful card, though. Okay, Ron Guidry, A3, and the Pittsburgh Pirates team card from 1980 Tops the year prior when we won the World Series, the last time we won the World Series. We are a family, 79 Pittsburgh Pirates. If you don't know, don't already know, I'm from, I live in Pittsburgh. I'm from Pittsburgh, and the Pirates are always our team. Um, okay, nice Reggie following this. You got a 66 here, Al Worthington. Beautiful stuff here. Reggie from 79. Frank Tanana, rookie cup card from 75. Bobby Valentine. What year is this one from? You gotta be kidding me! Holy smokes. Okay, it's a sporting news. What year is this from? Hold on. I'm putting this down here. I'm gonna look this up. See, what, see if I got overexcited or if I have every right to scream and yell. Um, hold on a second, guys. My son's dived into my tablet and, like, are, are all over the map here. I'm, like, exiting things. That's why it's slow. Hold on. Um, let's see. Because there's no date in the back here. And um, we're going to find out what year this is from. Hold on a second. Because, honestly, I don't know. And I should know with the back of the card, but I'm, I'm not. Let's see. Mickey. Mantle. Uh, sporting news. Let's see. Tops. Sporting. Come on. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to, you know, sometimes you got to do things like this and you guys don't mind. Uh, top sporting news card number. Um, let's see what number this is too. It's number 471. Number 471. Okay, let's look. 62. Wait, no. Yeah, 62. Unbelievable. Where's my penny sleeve? That is beautiful. Unbelievable. Unreal. Okay, we got a Mickey Mantle card out of here, and it's... Older than the one, the other one that I have. We've got three now. That's beautiful, good stuff there. Who I, I got to take down Robin Yount. I'm sorry, Mr. Yount. Um, there you go with that. That is awesome. Yes. Neighbors hate me. My neighbors hate me. Larry Sorensen from A Tops. What a way to end this too. We got one more thing to pull out of here too. Rick Wise from A Two. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Now, I should have known with the back, but I don't think I've pulled very many 62 cards to begin with. So, um, apologize for the little delay there. Here's the last one. So, you got Johnny Growth for the, um, for the Detroit Tigers, 59. Very nice stuff there. Rick Roden from 77. Nice Thurman Munson from 75. All center, but we'll take that card. That's beautiful. Al Horboski. Terry Whitfield. Al Horboski from 76. Terry Whitfield was from is from 79. 
Save our relic for last. Let's see what it is. Chicago Cubs from 80 Tops. Ron Hassey from 82. And our other hit, our hit here is... Nice! You gotta be kidding me. Tops Finest. Willie Mays. Oh, beautiful. When he was on the Mets at the end of his career. That's awesome. Say hey, Willie. The say hey, kid. That's beautiful. Nice. That's a nice... Uh, relic to get out of anywhere. This is beautiful, but this has been awesome. Let's um, highlight this as well. Wow, let's do a quick review. Um, I am very, very happy with this. I am still like kind of soaking in the mantle card here. Uh, I wasn't expecting to even find that and everything else we had. I mean, this is probably, my God, I mean, this might be the best of the box of all of them. So, and it's our last one, and it, there are no more. So, this is a great, awesome way to go out. Holy smokes. All right, let's showcase some cards here. And you guys can look at the back here while I get myself situated. Let's do the um, ones I wanted to pull out. And these aren't Hall of Famers, but um, yeah, nice 75 Thurman months. And the only reason why I'm showcasing these are because they're 71s. And they're rare in these boxes. And 72s as well. This one's Bert Hooten's rookie card. Nice Thurman Munson from 76. Hal McRae. Only because it's 72. Same thing with that crane pull, but some known names right there. Pedro Guerrero's rookie prospect card here. The Dodgers. And then this is Lou Sweet Lou. Lou Whitaker's from 70. Um, from 78. It's very nice. Okay, the older cards, um, let's do those. The Vintage, 59, Johnny Growth. Um, and these are just, look at the back of these. You got 1966, Al Worthington, Paul Lindblad. Another 59, Whitey Lockman. Jose Tartable from 66, right? Yep. This was very nice too, 1970. Uh, I only put this in here because of uh, Jerry Royce. This is a rookie card. Laurent Lee as well. All the other all the other seventies cards in the pile um, on the other side here. Sixty three, Carmelo carry on, and I'm highlighting this. It's nineteen seventy tops. We I don't know how many of the other seventies seventy tops we pulled, but this is Hank's brother. So um, Tommy Aaron, which I was wasn't even aware of, and then you've got a Joe Gaines here, and this is from uh, sixty six as well. So those are vintage cards that we found inside the box. Hall of Famers, got some really good ones. Uh, 79, Reggie Jackson. This is a really nice card. It's a little bit miscut, obviously, but I'll still take it. It's Hammer and Hank Aaron. Raleigh Fingers, Dennis Eckersley, Tom Seaver, Andre Dawson, Willie McCovey. Well, bad thing about that, it's got that on the back, which is kind of disappointing. That must have been a printing error. Lefty Grove, um, nice 77, George Brown. I mean, look at this stuff. Carl Yastrzemski, Reggie Jackson from 80 Tops. Nice Tony Perez. 76 Yaz, awesome. 82 Dawson, got a mantle. And um, Don Newcomb from 75. Henderson from 83. Um, leaders card there. It's a beautiful one. Ryan and Negro. The Babe from 76. Sporting News. Another Yaz from 80 and Johnny Bench from um, 79 tops. We got Robin Yount from 76. We got Wade Boggs rookie card. Unbelievable. Unreal. And uh, what else we get? That's not all, folks. We got um, 76 Nolan Ryan, 1970 Reggie Jackson. Uh, <laughs> Willie Mays uh, fabric with the pinstripe for the Mets. That's awesome. And a 62 Sporting News, 1962 top Sporting News Mickey Mantle. Yeah, you can't beat that. That's a great way to end this uh, product. If I ever get my hands on this again, I, if I ever see it again, I'm going to grab it and get my hands on it again. But uh, this has been one fun ride with this product. This is our fourth one. And this was just unbelievable just I, I don't even know what to say it's just it's just cool man it's very very cool good stuff here so if you have this at home already open yours up maybe make a video if you don't have a channel man it's a good way to start you out um and um yeah this has been the universal treasures 
2014 Universal Treasures. It's actually a rare item now because there are no more. It's sold out everywhere. And um, and you can maybe purchase on a, on eBay, but you're probably paying uh, a ton for it. So um, there you go. I'm very, very happy I was able to present this to you guys today. Again, this would have been awesome to go live. But again, it's the delay. Uh, it's the just uh, I have a ton of moderators now. I had a bunch of you guys. So when we go live again, which I will, um, you'll be able to help me out with the uh, live live chat stream. Um, but it's really mainly the delay, and I felt like I wasn't gonna, I, I wasn't getting uh, exposure just just for the live stream that I really really wanted to have. Not to say that wouldn't happen for this, but I didn't want to take any chances because um, I knew this would be a special thing, and I wanted to you know, just do it properly. If I ever get another box, then maybe we'll do that live. Um, or maybe we'll try the new one that might that's supposed to be coming out um, as well. That's all I got for you guys today. Hey, look, if you're not subscribed, you like to see here, hit that subscribe button right below my index finger. Give you a thumbs up like this video. How can you not like this? How could you not like this? Honestly, if you're a collector of cards and just, just you know, seeing all these different years, all these big names, how could you not like this? So shame on you if you vote a thumbs down on this. Go away. <laughs> That's what I say to you, thumbs down people. But most of you guys are you guys love this. Comment down below. Let me know what you think of these cars. Share this with your friends, family, loved ones. The eBay store link is down below in the description. Like I always say, go check it out. Uh, we might have a bonus video this week over the mail day again. And then we'll have a bunch of new stuff next week. Have a great rest of your Friday, guys. Have a nice weekend if you don't catch us on our bonus video. And we'll see you guys next week as well. Thanks again for watching, John. Guys, this is John John Sports Cards signing off, and hey, we'll see you all soon.